in the distant echo of flickering cathode rays, where nostalgia dances hand in hand with innovation, lies a timeless portal to the past, the enigmatic year of 1982. As you traverse the corridors of memory, do you recall that moment, that spark, when you first laid eyes upon the iconic TV series, TJ, Hooker? It's like peering through a sepia-tinted window into an era where crime-fighting met the heart-pounding rhythm of city streets. The show's arrival was more than just a debut. It was an introduction to the grit and drama that would etch itself into your consciousness, a memory you'd carry like a hidden badge. Perhaps it was the resonating charisma of William Shatner, stepping out of the Starfleet's shadow into the shoes of Sergeant Thomas Jefferson Hooker, that drew you in. Or maybe it was the kaleidoscope of those unforgettable moments, framed in the whirlwind of police pursuits, dramatic confrontations, and the relentless chase of justice. Every scene was a canvas painted with suspense, marked by those unforgettable split-second decisions that kept you perched on the edge of your seat. As the sirens wailed and the city's pulse quickened, there was an aura of authenticity that set TJ Hooker apart. The show wasn't just about chasing criminals, it was about unraveling the complexities of human nature and the choices that define us. It was about camaraderie in the face of danger, about the moments that tested not only the character's mettle but also our own capacity for empathy and understanding. And now, as we step beyond the threshold of memory into the realm of facts, let's unravel some hidden truths about the show that may have eluded even the most dedicated of fans. These gems, tucked away like clues in a thrilling mystery, unveil the intricacies behind the scenes, the inspirations that breathed life into each episode, and the impact that T.J. Hooker left on the television landscape. So, my fellow time traveler through the annals of TV history, fasten your seatbelt and brace yourself for a journey through the corridors of time. From the inception to the legacy, well uncover the layers that made T.J. Hooker a hallmark of its era and an echo that resonates even now. T.J. Hooker, a television series that premiered in 1982, is a crime drama that follows the life of Thomas Jefferson Hooker, a tough and determined veteran police officer. The show was created by Rick Husky and lasted for five seasons until 1986. Set in the fictional city of LCPD, the series revolves around the daily challenges and experiences of police officers as they strive to maintain law and order. The iconic character of T.J., Hooker is portrayed by William Shatner, best known for his role as Captain Kirk in Star Trek. Hooker is a no-nonsense cop with a strong moral compass, often going beyond the call of duty to ensure justice is served. Alongside him is Adrian Zemed as Officer Vince Romano, Hooker's young and enthusiastic partner. Their dynamic adds depth to the show, blending Hooker's seasoned wisdom with Romano's energetic spirit. T.J. Hooker stands out with its unique blend of action-packed sequences, intense drama, and moral lessons. The show often explores themes of loyalty, justice, and the complexities of police work. It combines gritty street-level crime-solving with character-driven narratives, engaging viewers in both the cases and the personal lives of the officers. The series had a significant impact on popular culture, leaving a lasting impression on audiences. It further solidified William Shatner's status as a television icon beyond his Star Trek fame. T.J. Hooker contributed to the portrayal of police procedurals on television, influencing subsequent shows in the genre. Now, delving into intriguing trivia about the show, it's interesting to note that the series originally aired on ABC and was later picked up by CBS for its final two seasons. The show's title character, T.J. Hooker, was initially supposed to be a tough, no-nonsense character played by Jeff Goldblum, but the role underwent a transformation after William Shatner was cast. The series featured a number of guest appearances by well-known actors, adding to its appeal. One memorable aspect is the iconic scene of Hooker clinging to the hood of a moving car, a moment that has become synonymous with the show's action-packed nature. Additionally, the show's portrayal of police work and its emphasis on the human side of law enforcement set it apart from other crime dramas of its time. In conclusion, T.J. Hooker remains a notable entry in television history, blending action, drama, and moral themes through its compelling characters and unique style. Its impact on the portrayal of police procedurals and its cultural influence endure to this day, making it a show that continues to be remembered and appreciated. And that's a wrap on the overview and insights about T.J. Hooker. Unveiling the legacy of T.J. 
Hooker, a tribute to the unconventional inspiration in the annals of television history. The year 1982 marked the debut of a show that would captivate audiences with its gritty crime narratives and rugged charm, T.J. Hooker. While the series itself weaved tales of police drama, it also harbored an intriguing backstory that mirrored the show's own evolution. The brainchild of creator Rick Husky, the show underwent a metamorphosis from its initial concept leading to the birth of the iconic character we now know as T.J. Hooker. Initially conceived as the Protectors, the show's pilot bore the intended title. A brainchild of Rick Husky, who sought to rejuvenate his prior success, The Rookies, the series was conceived as an ensemble cast-driven venture. However, fate had a different plan, one intertwined with the name that would soon become synonymous with the show's essence, Hooker. The pivotal shift came when the pilot showcased the unmistakable presence of William Shatner. The decision makers, recognizing Shatner's magnetic portrayal, pivoted the show's focus squarely onto his character, T.J. Hooker. This marked the genesis of a transformation that culminated in the show's title being realigned to mirror its new central figure. Curiously, the appellation Hooker wasn't arbitrarily chosen. Rather, it paid homage to the enigmatic Civil War Union General Joseph Hooker. A nod to history, this choice infused the character with an intriguing layer of legacy, aligning the present-day crime fighter with a storied past. Behind this revolutionary shift lay the resolute conviction of creator Rick Husky. His vision was singular, only one actor was destined to breathe life into T.J. Hooker, and that luminary was none other than William Shatner. A testament to Shatner's unparalleled embodiment of the character, this decision solidified the show's trajectory and indelible mark on television history. As the credits rolled and the episodes unfolded, T.J. Hooker carved a unique niche in the landscape of television. Its genesis story, with its twists and turns, mirrored the very essence of the narratives it would go on to tell. A legacy of the show endures, a testament to the synergy between creator, actor, and the serendipitous winds of change. So there you have it, a glimpse into the captivating tale behind the creation of T.J. Hooker, a show that bore witness to metamorphosis, paid homage to history, and forever etched the name Hooker into the annals of television lore. The unit number four, Adam 3-0, an intriguing insight into T.J. Hooker's police lingo in the iconic 1982 TV series T.J. Hooker. The synergy between the characters was palpable, but it wasn't just the chemistry that captivated audiences. Behind the scenes, an intricate unit numbering system added a layer of authenticity to the show's police procedural aspect. The detective duo Hooker and Romano rolled out in Unit 4 Adam 3-0, while Corrigan and Sheridan patrolled as 4 Adam 1-6. This cryptic code held the key to division, unit type, and section, mirroring the real-life LAPD division codes. The framework, divulged in an episode of Adam 12, another classic police drama, delineated a meticulous structure. The numeric prefix indicated the division, and the alphabetic component, like Adam, spelled out the unit type to officer teams, in this case. The ensuing digits pinpointed the section within the division. As 4 Adam 3-0 and 4 Adam 1-6 zoomed through the streets of La, it was more than a mere number, it was an embodiment of the series' commitment to authenticity. The rabbit hole led further, unveiling a list of police stations with corresponding numbers. For instance, 4 stood for the Hollenbeck Police Station, nestled at 2111 East 1st Street, a subtle nod to geographic precision. The web of numerals stretched, capturing the essence of the sprawling city's law enforcement landscape, until the show's final curtain. A deeper dive into the 80 seconds icon, TJ, Hooker's numerical connection while the engines roared and sirens blared in TJ. Hooker, one consistent yet enigmatic detail remained in patrol car numbers. Every time Hooker and Romano hit the streets, their vehicle bore the number 49,357. This seemingly innocuous touch added an element of familiarity for avid viewers, subtly etching a numerical imprint in their memory. A simple sequence, but one that underscored the show's commitment to continuity and the finer details. From Starship Captain to TV Cop, William Shatner's dual triumph, William Shatner, revered as Captain James T. Kirk in the Star Trek franchise, embarked on a different odyssey with T.J. Hooker. While Star Trek, the original series blazed a trail in pop culture, it ran for a relatively brief three seasons. In a surprising twist, Shatner found himself part of not one, but two scripted shows that outpaced the original Star Trek series in terms of seasons. 
Boston Legal, where Shatner portrayed the charismatic Denny Crane, stood as the other jewel in his crown. Both Boston Legal and T.J. Hooker enjoyed a robust five-season run, demonstrating Shatner's versatility and enduring appeal beyond the cosmic frontier. These mid-season replacements resonated with audiences, offering a testament to Shatner's enduring magnetism on the small screen. And so, in the world of T.J., Hooker, where codes and numbers wove a subtle narrative beneath the action-packed surface. William Shatner's portrayal of the tenacious cop added yet another layer of intrigue to a show that continues to be fondly remembered by fans. As we bid adieu to the world of T.J., Hooker, let's pause for a moment and let the echoes of sirens and the flash of patrol car lights stir up a whirlwind of memories. This 1982 TV series didn't just grace our screens, it etched itself into the fabric of our lives. Maybe it was the heart-pounding pursuit of justice, the camaraderie that transcended uniforms, or the thrill of witnessing life on the thin blue line. Whatever it was, T.J. Hooker became more than a show, it became an emblem of nostalgia, a reel of moments that mirrored our own experiences, both within and beyond the realm of law enforcement. Think back to those evenings when the flicker of the television transported you to the gritty streets of the city. Remember the suspense that held you captive, the characters who walked a tightrope between duty and desire, and the stories that unraveled like life itself. T.J. Hooker wasn't just a series, it was a journey, a journey that intertwined with your own. As we navigate the landscapes of our own lives, let's take a detour down memory lane. Share your stories, your reflections, and your favorite fragments from the world of T.J. Hooker. Let's celebrate the way it made us feel, the lessons it imprinted on us, and the connections it forged. So, gather your thoughts, unleash the floodgates of memory, and let's relive those moments together. Your tales are the living legacy of T.J. Hooker, a testament to its enduring impact on our lives. Thank you for sharing your heart and your experiences. Until we meet again to reminisce, take care, and keep the spirit of T.J. Hooker alive in your stories. Warm regards your title, position, 